Hi, everyone. Welcome to New to the Street. I'm Anna Berry. Today, I'm speaking with Terry Lee Bennett, the operational manager for Blue Sparrow Token, a division of the crypto exchange Bluebit. Welcome, Terry. Hi, Anna. Thanks for having me. It's very good we're to excited. be here. Yeah, we're excited to hear a little bit about Blue Sparrow. Tell us about the vision behind it. Yeah, so this is where our passion comes in. So the vision behind Blue Sparrow is was specifically to help people. Uh, the devs and the founder, Suzumi, they thought, how can we help people? You know, what's a good way to get as many things to as many people? So we thought charity and giveaways. So, you know, everyone likes to win prizes. So we actually pioneered a real world concept of sort of daily giveaways and developed that into the crypto world. So we've developed a draw system. Uh, which has never been done before in the crypto world. So it was very exciting for us to do that. Uh, and to be eligible to win the prizes, your your crypto wallet number is essentially an entry ticket into, into our daily draws. And all you need to do is hold 250 tokens in a DeFi wallet, which at the moment is about $40. And then you're automatically entered into our daily giveaway draws every single day. There's seven winners. And that means that per wallet, you've got 2,555 chances a year to win. So, and many people, they have multiple wallets and multiple chances of winning. And so far, we've given away over $600,000 to our holders in about eight months uh, since we launched, which is amazing. It's such a nice thing to do, you know, to our, to our holders. And Suzumi, the founder, his mission is, is basically to change the way people see the crypto market. Um, and, you know, by giving these hope to people every single day, you know, we have lots of people from many parts of the world that may, maybe don't earn a lot of money. So this is a way for them, to, you know, to boost their salaries and things. Uh, and, and this is what leads me on to my next point, actually. You know, everyone talks about hodling and diamond handing, but no one is really rewarded for doing that unless the market's on a bull run. So mm -hmm. with Blue Sparrow, you know, our holders are actually winning every day, no matter whether the market's up or down, we have that competition. Um, so it's really exciting. And the way that we do that, the way that that is actually possible is with our tokenomics. So we have a 1% uh, like tax, like a fee that's charged. It's like the new thing now in crypto. And that 1% comes round, back around to the holders in one way or the other. So 0.2% goes to the draw fund. So that gets delivered back to the holders. Um, then there's 0 0.4 that goes to rewards and a burn mechanism. Uh, and finally, the last 0.4% goes to charity and marketing. Wow. Um, so it's very exciting. This does seem like a revolutionary uh, technology that you have there with, with a heart and a soul. I like that a lot. Um, so let's go into that. Tell me about your charity wallet fund. How's that been used so far? Yeah, so this is one thing that, that's very close to my heart. So 0.4% um, goes to that charity and marketing fund. So then we, we take the fraction out of that for the marketing and charity. This means that every time anyone buys or sells Blue Sparrow, they are directly contributing to our charity projects. Uh, Suzumi, our founder, he has added another 60000 on top of that, which we've actually used to build two schools, uh, one in Kenya, in Africa, in the Masai Mara region, uh, which, you know, there's no electricity or home comforts that we're used to there. Uh, I've been there myself. I've met our charity leaders. It's a completely different world. Uh, and our second school is in the Middle East. Uh, and we've, we built this school from the ground up, essentially. So I spoke to Izo um, and his wife over in Kenya. They're our charity leaders. They gathered the volunteers. They bought all the materials with the money. Uh, and that's the, the Blue Sparrow School is now up. And we're so proud of that, you know. Um, but then we had the issue where, and I, I know this from firsthand as I went there, the duties of the, of the girls there is to collect clean water. So it sort of, it takes all day for these girls to, um, find clean water. So we decided to actually build a water tower so that they can get the water quickly, have free running water, and then they can go to school. Um, so yeah, we're really happy that the children actually enrolled in their new term in April, just gone. Uh, they bless their hearts. They painted us lots of drawings and paintings to say thank you. Uh, and it's something that everyone that's been part of Blue Sparrow, you know, they all can be very proud of this. Uh, and one last thing actually about that as well, which I also find very close to my heart, is the women from these tribes, uh, they came to our charity leaders and said, um, you know, no leader or politician has actually been able to achieve such a development in such a short amount of time. Uh, and for us, this is just the beginning of our goals ahead for the charity. Wow, this really is fascinating. It shows with the power of a group of people coming together and creating this technology and, and giving 
giving it uh, forward to others. Uh, this, I see a documentary in the making with this as well, Terry. Yeah, I know. I would love to do that. I would, and any chance for me to go back and visit them, like, honestly, I want to try and get them back there this year. There's right. a huge blue sparrow painting on the, on the back of the classroom. So, and it's, uh, it's wonderful. I think the children, I hope, will start to think about crypto in something that maybe they've never thought of, and now they are, which is, which is fabulous. Exactly. And hopefully we can all start thinking about crypto in a different way like this, giving back. So um, talk to me about your uh, centralized exchange. You recently launched uh, Bluebit. Tell us about it. Yeah. So this was a fantastic announcement that we we launched. So we announced it in the start of the year uh, and then we actually launched it in March, just gone. So it's called Bluebit.io. It's a very powerful trading centralized exchange that offers trading on all levels, beginner or, or otherwise. Um, you know, there's many crypto exchanges in the market. However, we don't just offer crypto. We offer gold, other precious metals, oil, gas, forex trading. Uh, and the reason we can offer all this is because we've actually partnered with the world-renowned MetaTrader, uh, MT5, uh, which basically means when you make an account with Bluebit, you can get direct access to the entire financial market. Um, you know, we've got 700 instruments across seven asset classes. Uh, very easy registration. We've got now just launched an iOS trade trading app in the App Store. So you can keep an eye on your wallet and your trades on the go, which was, was very good. Apple can be quite difficult to get an app out. So that was something that we were very proud of as well. And then we've got a, uh, a profit share program. So for anyone uh, that wants to uh, introduce any of their friends or family members or business partners that you introduce to Bluebit, you will actually receive 20% of all of their successful trades. So maybe you're not a trader, but your friends or family are, you know, you can send them a link, your QR code link and that you're going to benefit from their trading, which is, which is fabulous. Um, and then lastly on the blue exchange, uh, when you actually buy blue Sparrow, you are literally holding the official native token to a centralized exchange. And, you know, as we all know, they tend to do extremely well. It is the blue sparrow to blue bit is what BNB is to Binance. So that's uh, if this is just very on the more early stage of it. So it's a great entry point, we believe. Okay. Well, with the blue sparrow being the native token to blue bit. So what, what are the expectations and the forecasts looking like? So this is one thing that really excites me really, because um, we changed from V2 to uh, V1 to V2. So our circulating supply now is absolutely golden. We've, we have a hundred million total supply. We've burned over 53 million. Uh, so they've been completely taken out of the market. So now we're left with just over 46 million in circulation right now. Um, when we look at the projects on the market that have a very similar supply to what we have, they are upwards of $40 plus, you know, our all time high was around a dollar. So we know when the market starts to make a reversal that, you know, our first stop is there. And then beyond that, you know, the sky's the limit. Um, utility for us is everything. And we're very prepared for this. We, we do believe that the more that we innovate and develop and adapt to this fast paced space, the more we're going to surpass those expectations. Uh, we also have an active burn mechanism with our tax, which means that Blue Sparrow is forever deflationary. You know, the longer you hold on to your Blue Sparrow, the fewer they're going to be in the market. Uh, and I think for a long-term investor uh, and myself personally, this is very, very important. You know, I think anything that you can get into at the moment that hedges against the inflation rates is, is something that is golden for me. Uh, and this aspect of our tokenomics is just crucial for basically the longevity of where we're going. Right. Where are we going? It's a volatile market out there, but tell us, give us some good news. What's some future plans that investors yeah. are excited about? So something really exciting, apart from everything we just spoke about, is now we've just announced that um, we are going into the NFT market. So our community is one of the most important things to us. And we, we, we've done lots of meetings, lots of data analyzing, current market trends, et cetera. Uh, and so we decided to create and develop the Bluebit NFT marketplace. Uh, we'll be rolling this out in two phases, starting in July. So it's very, very close. Uh, we've got tons of features. It'll feature, feature lazy minting, uh, three different blockchains. Users can actually split royalties between different artists, which I think is amazing in this current market. Uh, the lazy minting is my personal favorite because I do see many artists on Twitter, for example. They create fabulous work. Um, but maybe they don't have the money for the upfront costs. So with lazy minting, you are only paid for the minting costs once it's actually sold. 
So it's a range between the seller and the buyer once it's completed. You know, I think there's some stunning talent out there and it's, it, this is a good way for them to showcase what they have without actually having to spend anything up front. And then for the end user, you know, we're going to have a much bigger catalog of things to see because people can push their work out much more easily as well. So very exciting for the NFT marketplace. All right. Well, the future looks golden for you guys and all that you're doing, giving back as well. It's fascinating technology here. So if people are interested in buying, what's that process like? Uh, very, very easy. You can buy through Blue Bluebit itself, uh, but we've got a simple exchange, very easy, just almost like a DEX inside a CX. So a, a DeFi, you know, like a Uniswap type of swap. You can actually do that within our centralized exchange. Uh, we're on 12 different exchanges as well, other exchanges. Uh, as well as the usual DeFi. Um, and yeah, it's very, very simple. Uh, we're on plenty, lots and lots of different platforms. Um, and if anyone ever needs any help, they can feel free to message uh, any me on, on Twitter or any of our team. We're always glad to help as well. Um, we do lots and lots of AMAs on Twitter. So if anyone's free to come and have a, have a chat with us. Uh, we're quite community orientated. We, we like to be out in the public speaking to people, especially during you know bear markets, things like that. Right. I can see that you guys do have a great presence out there. Well, thank you so much for joining us on new to the street. And we look forward to you coming back again and giving us these meaningful updates. Thank you so much, Anna. It's been a pleasure. All right. Thank you all for watching. Thank you.